Good morning, everybody. I don't think it's morning anymore. So. Good afternoon, everybody. <laughs> we had another uh, productive morning of getting the apartment ready, kind of retraining the dog to live here because she's used to city living in Chicago. Um, so we have internet now. So if you're watching yesterday's vlog, that was up on our Florida internet. First Disney bought food of our new life. Is this surprising at all? This is a holiday sandwich. And I got the um, the buffalo chicken. Then where are we gonna go after this? Uniqlo. And? Oh. Little place. It's gonna sell us our annual passes. That is the exact reason why we're actually here, ironically enough, to get some rain jackets. Because living in Chicago, you don't do rain jackets. But we live in Florida now. So we're trying to find some cute Mickey and Minnie rain jackets. And supposedly, Uniqlo has them. I got an update, we found them. I don't know if we have Sarah's though. So. But I like it. Hello. I like it a Hello. lot. It's kind of Epcot-ish. Yeah. With Mickey Mouse's on it. Okay. Gonna keep me dry. Guess what? Hmm. What did we just buy? Before? Show just show them. Just show them. No, you got it. You got, we got our Uniqlo oh. bags. We got our, our, our rain parkas. Got I'm just kidding. We got our annual passes. We are official Disney World annual pass holders. We have to order our Magic Vans and go to Magic Kingdom. Well, can, we, can we play with the idea of going to Magic Kingdom today? Play. See if our friend's going to be decide what she wants to do. Okay. If not, we'll think about it. If not, tomorrow? Yeah. Booyah! Or the next day. Or the next day. Or the next day. Or the next 365 the next 364 days. I think, I don't know how I'm still breathing right now because we just got annual passes and everything is amazing here. But look what we found. <laughs> Mickey Mouse squeaky toys, dog holes, vests, Eve needs a premium bar. adults and went home and cooked dinner instead of getting corn dog nuggets and to see our dog and to see our dog so yeah we've been we went at home getting a little straightened up and we are you know hey i was gonna surprise them and go but instead we're just gonna go here ready three uh and two Woo! see Apple after for the first time ever. ever yeah we were in an uber the last time we went on property and we were literally like biting our tongues like going under there like we couldn't like give our full yeah. jefferson, excitement jefferson our driver would have been okay but <laughs> i think it would have been creeped out so we had a hiccup in our plan we were gonna tell you guys how long it took for us to park in the parking lot to get to ttc to go through security and then to get to the park for anybody who'd like to know. But we had a very goofy tram driver because it's later in the day, so I've got her Magic Kingdom parking is like self parking, so you get to park wherever you want, not precisely in spots. So it took a little bit. So we'll do that next time. But still, no, we can just say, like, on any given day, we parked at 7.45, and it's now 7.58. Um, so that's a full eight 14 minutes? minutes. 14 oh, minutes? Wait. wait. What time do we park? 45 plus. 13. Oh yeah, 13 minutes. 13, math. Math is good. Um, 13 minutes, and that was with like a little goofy train. Ma a, little, a little magic going on. Yeah. And I'm a, I'm a sucker for the ferry boat, so 
since we're just doing the fireworks night, maybe Splash Mountain, because someone didn't want to do it last time we were here. We we're going to do the ferry boat, because I love that ride. And just walk in and find a good spot on Main Street. So it's 8.13? 8.14, took three 13. minutes. Right, but now we're in the park. Now we're in the park and we used our pass holder pass for the first time. We parked at 7.45, so that's just under a half hour. And that was with a goofy cast member for the for the tram. Yeah, but a pretty easy ferry ride, so. It's beautiful. That's we're a good find representation. The best spot in the whole world to watch fireworks, which is right in front of Walter let's, Mickey. Let's take a look. So we found a good spot for Happy Ever After, and we got fast passes for Splash Mountain because if you saw our last vlog vacation here, we didn't end up going to Splash Mountain, so we're going there right after Happy Ever After, but we're not going to vlog any of this because we want to enjoy it for the first time, like fully, not worry about the camera angles or yeah. focuses and stuff. Same reason as we didn't film Wishes last time, we're not going to film our first time, and we'll be back. That was great. It was so good. I don't know. I mean, there's a lot of things. There's a lot of our friends and people on the internet that are diehard wishes, and so, so are we. It does not be wishes. I know. Beforehand, I was chanting, "We want Jiminy. We want Jiminy." But that was really, really good, yeah. and I think a lot of it has to do with like our situation. Literally, this is the first full day of us living in Orlando, and if you listen to like the the whole like story and meaning behind Happy Ever After, like we are following our dreams. So relevant. We are doing challenges every way, every, the way we live every day molds us. So us coming to Disney World and getting annual passes and relocating our lives here to do Disney World, to do the rest of Orlando. Like I think that makes it, it, it hit us a little bit more. things as even the day one as being a Florida resident and annual pass holder we didn't know what it, the parking lot looked like when it was uh, when the first come was it standby they called it standby parking no. self park self park so we parked like towards the back because that was like oh it's 7 p.m. let's park in the back no we probably could have found a spot way in the front but Our car is actually right here, so that wasn't a bad walk at all. Wait, we're in, we're not, we're in Hook. We're in Scar. We're in Scar 415, oh. Oh, which is right there, our car's right there. Great. So we're at our car, it was only like a five minute walk, which we thought was gonna be more, but it was great. Thank you for following us along our adventurous first full day. We have many more to show you and share with you. So do not forget to give us a thumbs up, like it, thumbs up again and subscribe to us. It is good to be home. It is certainly good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>